I joined the army in uh, um, October 28th, 1997. I was in um, Baghdad, and we're there at night. I got shot. I got shot in the head. I don't remember it. I don't know what happened. I don't. I don't know that. But I know. I know that um, somehow the uh, the guys with me, they saved my life. Patrick's injury. He was shot in his left temple. His injuries were so serious at the time that he was shot while he was on patrol in Baghdad. They did uh, surgery on him at a Balad Air Force Base, Air Force Hospital. They basically removed about 40% of his skull, but there was a, some complication. So he was airlifted that day. I met him with my brother-in-law at Bethesda Naval Hospital at around 11 o'clock. He still had written on him when, I guess when you're hurt, they write your social security number like uh, across your chest with like a, uh, a marking pen. And he was, it was like that fresh off the battlefield. His boots were in a bag. We were just glad that he was alive. In the beginning, it was catastrophic. Um, they really didn't know if he was gonna survive. Um, we just, it was just kind of day by day, hour by hour. And the doctors really couldn't tell how well his recovery would, would go or what he would get back, what he wouldn't. So we just had to be patient and plug along. I had a lot of fear that how are we going to get this across or persuade the VA um, or, or make them understand Pat's condition. I first learned about MVLSP uh, from an article that a uh, military spouse wrote uh, that uh, really highlighted the organization and what, what a great job they were doing for wounded service members and their families. This was a veteran who suffered horrific wounds. He lost the use of his right leg, his right arm. He lost his smell, taste, touch. Patrick couldn't lift his head off a pillow for nine months. He, he couldn't speak, he couldn't move his right side for over a year. We realized that the VA had under-evaluated his disabilities and we felt with our help we could get him the maximum amount of VA benefits and happily we did. All we really wanted was to be able to maintain our lifestyle as it is today when in retirement. And with NVLSP, we're allowed to do that. We are experts in one area of law and we get to use that expertise in a way that changes heroes' lives. I never thought it was gonna be like this. I never thought I could talk that much at all. They've done everything for me and they've been helping me the whole time and I just can't, it's just thank you. I, I wanna say thank you, everybody there.